I want to say thank you to everyone in this room. You know, it's like my second time at the rodeo. <laughs> and I want to definitely thank Lila and all these amazing actors. I want to talk really briefly about 1508. That is the year that allegedly when the first English language version of this play, Every Man, was written. Okay, so this is a time when famine and plague still abound, when medicine can't address very simple injuries. Average life expectancy is somewhere between 35 and 45. So um, this is a time when death is very much at the center of life. So in that kind of constellation of variables, and certainly many, many more, my sense is that this is a time when the need to find a roadmap towards salvation seems really urgent. All of my secular cynicism aside, I feel deeply grateful that I am standing beside a person who in his iconoclastic wit and humor and intelligence and wisdom has invited me to hear inside of this very old play some questions that speak to me now with enormous personal and cultural existential urgency. I'm really looking forward to it. I feel like I'm in very good company. Thanks, Brandon. Thanks, guys. <laughs>